please subscribe and you can download this code from description below. In Python, the OS.path module has been a go-to choice for working with file paths and manipulating file and directory names. However, as of Python 3.4 and later, the pathlib module has become the preferred way for handling paths. Pathlib offers a more intuitive and object-oriented approach to working with file system paths and is considered more robust and user-friendly than the traditional OS.path module. In this tutorial, we'll explore the pathlib module and its features with code examples to demonstrate its capabilities. Pathlib provides several advantages over OS.path, including Object-oriented approach, Pathlib represents paths as objects, which makes it more intuitive and easier to work with. Platform independent, Pathlib automatically handles differences in path syntax between different operating systems, example Windows and Unix-like systems. Cleaner code, code written with Pathlib tends to be more readable and concise. Path composition, it allows easy path composition and manipulation. Method chaining, you can chain methods together for more complex operations. Now, let's dive into the pathlib module with code examples. To start using pathlib, you first need to import it. To create a path object representing a file or directory, simply provide the path as a string to the path constructor. You can easily check if a file or directory exists using the exists method. To create a new directory, use the mkdir method.